Yo, what's good guys? Welcome back to another American Horror Story Hotel Reaction. Sorry that it's been so long, man. I humbly apologise. Um, basically, I'll explain. I'll explain why I was gone for like two months. But I've actually been spending time with my girlfriend. She actually recently moved in about a month ago. So I've just been getting used to that. Um, the reason for this is because it's like it's quite messy in my room at the moment so the both of us came up with an idea to hang a bed sheet or a duvet sheet from the ceiling so then like you got me you just got me like there's no background or anything there's a bit of background over there that's my curtain for the window but yeah that's the only like background you can see I was a bit like uncomfortable showing you guys the mess in my room so an easy workaround was literally just hang a sheet up and then there's no distractions or anything there's no like there's nothing you can see in the background that will distract you um as for the hair i'm still growing it out it looks unbelievably terrible at the moment at the back it seems to look okay at the front um i'm hoping to grow it out into like a a bun or something to see just to see how it looks if it looks shit then i'm gonna I'm going to cut it off and have probably have the same hairstyle that I used to have before lockdown. But because lockdown happened and there was no barbers open, I just fully embraced it. I haven't trimmed my beard during lockdown at all and I haven't cut my hair. So, yeah, I'm kind of like halfway. I'm at the halfway mark, so I might as well just keep going. And if it looks shit, I'll cut it off. But yeah, there's no harm in trying. Anyway, American Horror Story Hotel. What can I say about that? I think it was episode 5 that I last watched. Bear in mind, I haven't watched it for two months. Again, I'm sorry. I am sorry. Yeah, it was. It was episode 5, wasn't it? So what I can remember, yeah. The mum, or the wife of John. She's basically just disregarded their daughter, yeah. I've forgotten her name already. But she's always wanted to be with Holden. So she's just completely disregarded her daughter. But yeah, the mum is now a vampire. Lady Gaga turned her, to, uh, turned her into a vampire. And then the mum was looking after some really sick kid at hospital. And then I think to save him, she injected his bag thing, whatever, with her blood, which is obviously vampire blood. And then that kid turned into a vampire also. And then there was this whole thing at a school where the school kids started massacring the teachers by killing them and sucking on their blood and then the police came in like a SWAT team and they were like oh my god kids are you okay and then they all had the same cover story which was quite clever like no one would ever think that it was the kids that done it they just said it oh it was a shooter or whatever yeah school shooter but couldn't they just do an autopsy on the bodies that were found in the school and then see that there's been bite marks and then they could probably measure the bite marks and say this isn't from an adult mouth this is from a child's mouth right surely they can do that but i mean they might do it i don't know kathy bates iris she killed the two really annoying people that spent the night at the hotel they were just like belittling um iris like proper so then she does she just done that man she's fucking sliced the both of them they had it coming man they had it coming desiree as well desiree has i think she's recruited donovan for like a revenge kind of task against lady gaga i think john's been sacked as well from the police yeah okay john got sacked from the police i think for uh i think his mental health people are like oh you've lost your son you're still not fit to come to work john's like no don't you understand i saw serial killers at my hotel and they're like yeah whatever man and then then i think john slept with sally which he has no memory of i still don't get the deal with sally i don't get the deal with sally what predictions did i have as well i bear predictions lady gargo is the wife or was the wife of james patrick march she ratted him out so he can get all his money and his fortune and she wants and lady gaga wants to do the same to will drake she wants to marry him and have his money and that so kind of a correlation there between the two stories and the copycat killer 
would have to be a vampire as well because they keep happening at night and someone keeps trying to and they they knew about John Detective John is that his name Detective John they knew about him and they were trying to call him over to the hotel whoever the serial killer is so it could be Lady Gaga as well I don't know I'm just gonna get into episode six. Oh, we also had a nice kind of flashback storyline to Liz Taylor about how she became herself and that and how accepting Lady Gaga was of her, which was nice. It was a nice backstory to see halfway through the halfway through the series. But yeah, this is episode six of Hotel. It is called Room Thirty Three. Hmm. Looks like murder house. Oh Don't shit! It is. Oh my god. I'm married. You see. To James Patrick March. Is this Charles Montgomery? It must be. Where's Nora? At? Let's dispose of that. I think it's still alive. Whoa, whoa. Ah, oh, is this why he became fascinated with stitching shit together? It's a boy. Why do you mean, congratulations, it's a boy? You've just seen your assistant mutilated on the floor. You're not going to ask, what the hell have I just seen here? What's, what's just come out of you? Interesting, though. I can't believe that was Murder House. I saw the house and I thought, that is Murder House. Because the entrance was to the right. There was no gazebo, though, obviously, because it's set before uh, Ben Harmon and that joined. But yeah, cool. I didn't know that Murder House, or I didn't know that Hotel had a crossover with Murder House. It's kind of cool, kind of cool to see. Hi, Daddy. Fucking hell. Holden! You're going to see your wife? How did he get back in? Taylor and who dandy so good with you because you're an orphan orphans love girls like me because it's like mommy and daddy are both in the room <laughs> I think I love you don't tease me I'm serious <laughs> why couldn't I don't know how they even see you it's like you're genuinely happy to see me I believe you When you come down, it's like it's like it's Christmas morning for me. No, Will Drake. Don't talk to her about us just yet, okay? Let it be just ours for a little while longer. Ah, uh, man, is he going to be able to perform? Is he going to be able to perform now with the Countess? Surely the Countess knows everything too, it's her, she runs the place. I think you're having a psychotic break. Nah, man. I've been this way for a while. You need to get out of here and you need to get professional help. No. no. I'm going down to that room. I want to see for myself. You can come with me if you want. I don't like how Alex is treating her husband here. Saying he needs psychotic help when he's literally on the ball. He did see what he saw. And now she's fucking empty the swimming pool to make her look like he is going crazy. Ah, oh, fuck, fuck Alex, man. Yeah, fuck you. There's nothing here, John. I told you. Oh, 
Room of 33 is what it's called. Oh, could it be her son? I've got to go feed that thing in room 33. That's what Kathy Bates said in the first episode. Hello, my love. It is. It is her son. Yeah, let me see it then. Let me see the face of the kid. This is no place for children. Come on, let's go find the kids. No, 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 no. You find them. Because it sounds like you know what to do. But even with that done, she'll still have one more reason to go on, and I'm going to tend to that. So give me the key to room 33. Yes, let's go. She looks like us. Aimless. Leaving wet spots on the floor. Until she found her purpose. Way fuck. Kara enjoyed terrorizing the hotel guests. What's your purpose? I lost mine when I lost her. You need a purpose. So what was her pur What was Kara's purpose then? Killing people in the hotel. I thought he meant if you found a purpose, you then you can leave the hotel, but. I've got a surprise for you. Let me see the kid's face. Jesus. Who the hell are you? It's my friend Vendela. I want to play. This is some kind of scam. You two are pros. I'm getting double teamed and then you make me pay. No way, Jose. Mr. Wu does not pay for pussy. I'm gonna take a leak. You two better be gone when I come out. He's only saying that because he's nutted. And he can't get it up now. So he's like, nah, you two are pros. Fuck that. I don't want to freeze him. I have the perfect idea. Uh huh. Who's that then? I can't think of who that is. Oh, Lady Gaga, mate. John, come on. No. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Take this from me. This is my breakdown. I'm gonna have it. Break their minds. Why is she doing this to her husband? Run, John! <laughs> Get out of there! Fuck's sake, man. Have a bloody shower first. Oh no, Bartholomew! How did he get in the room? Evan? Oh fucking hell. There you go, you can see it. What is it, John? Can I see it now? How did he miss? He shot three times. Ah, he didn't miss. Ah, he didn't miss. Why can't I not see the bloody... what he looks like? No, well, Drake, don't fall for it. She's after no. your money. No! Try and speak to her again. No. no. I think it's best if you get her to her grandma's. No problem. 
Don't even want to talk to your own daughter, man. I hate Alex. I hate Alex in this. I loved her in Asylum when she played Shelly, but... Nah, not this. I think I am going crazy. So maybe if I get out of that place... You are out of that place. It's all that matters. You just need some sleep in your own house. In your own bed. It's your bed, too. Not you, John. You collect us and create us and get us addicted to the light of your love just so you can take it away. You feed off the heartbreak, knowing we're out there suffering over you. Well, not me. I was made for more than that. For a real love. Please, after all I've done, let me just have this one. Oh, no, man. Please don't kill Dandy. You may have. I knew it. I knew it. Yeah, time for a bit of fucking heartbreak for you now, Gaga. Get fucked. Yeah, he's not there, mate. Alex. You saved my son. You saved mine. How did she know that he, Bartholomew, was her kid, man? Has she ever mentioned it to Alex before? Alex is a bitch, man. I hate Alex. Oh my god. Oh, I finally saw the face. I can't believe. I can't believe. How's how's Lady Gaga getting all the luck here? Fuck. It's true what Dandy said to Lady Gaga. She feeds off heartbreak. And then when Liz Taylor and Dandy was like, please, let, let, let's, let's, let us just have each other. She was like, uh, okay. And then she killed Dandy. And now she's going to feed off of Liz Taylor's heartbreak over Dandy. Dandy got his spot on, man. I didn't even think about that. Lady Gaga feeds off heartbreak. That is disgusting. Disgusting. She's done it to Desiree. She's done it to Donovan. James Patrick March. I still believe. I still believe Lady Gaga was married to Patrick March. And her kid, Bartholomew. I'm sure it was, that was the name of the... That was the name of Charles and Nora Montgomery's kid in Murder House. And what was Charles Montgomery? He just saw his nurse get absolutely slaughtered by the kid. And then he goes, oh, congratulations, it's a boy. Is he not going to be like, what the fuck has just come out of you? Unless his assistant was a ghost or something and he knows that his house is full of ghosts. And if one of them dies, he knows they're already dead, so it's not like a big thing. Maybe that's why he got his experiments from. Like, he seemed really chill with Lady Gaga until he saw the monster. Because I remember he started sewing, like, back ears or pig ears to a bat or something later down the line and he started experimenting and he started getting more high off of that shit that he's breathing in i tell you what i hate alex i hate alex how can you treat your husband like this and your daughter you haven't called your daughter in two days and your daughter has just your daughter's going through something yeah where she, where she thinks that her dad's crazy Starting shooting the guns in the kitchen and shit. And she doesn't even want to go and talk to her daughter in the car. She's like, nah, better take her to her grandma's. Fuck you, Alex, man. 
I hate Alex in this show. What bitch? I don't, I don't know who I hate more. Alex or Lady Gaga? Lady Gaga just killed Dandy, man. But is he going to be a spirit in the hotel? Can vampires be spirits once they're dead in this hotel? Can they live on? Do they have to find a purpose? Liz Taylor's fucking heartbroken. I know Lady Gaga done all of that for Liz Taylor, but Liz Taylor was right. Like, she is going to age. And she you can't wait around forever like Lady Gaga for a, a true love of her life to come along. I don't know what's going to happen with John and Alex. I think... I think John needs to kill her. I really do. John needs to kill Alex. Who's going to kill Lady Gaga? I don't know. Lady Gaga could, could even survive this. I'm taking my headphones out, man. I don't need my headphones in. I'm not listening to anything. I, I can't believe Alex is doing this to her husband. I don't know how many times I've got to say it. She can happily watch her husband literally go insane. And she knows he's right as well. Like What he's seeing is right. Yet she's like, ah, oh, you need some psychotic help. Oh, fuck you, man. Who do you think you are? You, you've sold away your husband and your daughter, pretty much, for a random woman that you've never met who actually kidnapped your son to begin with. All those years of hatred towards John because he wasn't watching Holden. But the whole time he was kidnapped by Lady Gaga. And now she's saving... Lady Gaga's kid for her and that. What the hell is going on? I don't get the whole purpose thing either with the twins. Finding your purpose. Does that mean if they find their purpose they can leave the hotel or what? Or does it mean that they're entertained? Because they're there for eternity. Do they need to find their entertainment in order to enjoy life there? I don't know. That was a good episode though. Good episode. Saw James Patrick March briefly. He said you're finally checking into Hotel Cortez to John or whatever he said. Didn't really see Sally. Didn't see any of Sally. Sally is a very complex character, it feels like, man. I think there's more to Sally. There's a lot more to Sally, man. She's involved in this somehow. A lot more. Not really a lot of Iris either. What happened to the school that was massacred by the kids? Is there anything on that? Any follow-up on that at all? So what's Liz Taylor going to do? Liz Taylor could now team up with Donovan, Desiree, Iris, maybe Iris? Iris doesn't really have any bad blood against Lady Gaga, I don't think. Lady Gaga was the one that saved Donovan, let's not forget. Sally's the one that killed Donovan. Lady Gaga saved him. And if it wasn't for Lady Gaga reviving Donovan, then Donovan wouldn't have been able to revive Kathy Bates. So Kathy Bates is alive because of Lady Gaga. But late, but Kathy Bates and Liz Taylor they get on quite well, and now they're going to be conflicted, I think, because now. Liz Taylor's going to really hate Lady Gaga. Whereas Kathy Bates is kind of... I think she's on Lady Gaga's side. Because she had her two first victims the other day. And I think she enjoyed it. It sounds like she enjoyed it. Tasting their blood and shit. Anyway. Let me skim over. So I'm guessing now... The dead twin's purpose is just to fuck John. Or something. Like a really bloody... Sex... Yeah, that's it. Just bloody sex. That's what they want. I feel bad for Scarlet, most of all. I feel really bad for Scarlet. Hasn't heard from her mum. She thinks her dad's going insane. She's being shipped off to her grandma's. She said she saw Holden first. So she's probably thinking, I really want to see Holden, my brother, at that hotel. So Scarlet, all three of her family members... aren't really doing the best to look out for her kind of thing so yeah I feel bad for Scarlet I hope there's a bit of redemption for Scarlet somehow somewhere down the line 
Yeah. I might even leave it there. Bartholomew, I mean, I don't really have a lot to say about that. It is probably just a mutation, a mutated baby. I don't know how. Maybe it's because Lady Gaga is a vampire. Maybe that's how it was born like that. Or Lady Gaga had sex with a monster or something. I don't know, man. I can't I can't say anything about that. So yeah, Liz Taylor is definitely going to want revenge on Lady Gaga. It seems like the show, as it goes on, there's more and more people that have it out for Lady Gaga. If Dandy comes back as a spirit, that would be quite interesting. Because then he could like plot to kill Lady Gaga. He could have someone else kill her, maybe. Or he could do it himself, I don't know. But I hope Dandy gets some... Something... And I hope Lady Gaga gets her comeuppance for this. She's reigning, like, she's reigning terror over on the hotel when there's no need. What's the point, man? Why couldn't Liz Taylor be with Dandy? Dandy was right. You feed off the heartbreak, you don't love them at all. Feeds off heartbreak. And she couldn't let Liz Taylor be with someone that she felt like she truly loved. So yeah, I've got it out for Lady Gaga and Alex. My two hated people in this series so far, Alex and Lady Gaga. Fuck them both. Anyway, I'm going to stop it there. So thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this reaction, you can watch the full reaction over my Patreon. Uh, you can also watch the full reactions to Season 1, Murder House, Season 2, Asylum, Season 3, Coven, Season 4, Freak Show. We're on Season 5 now. You can also watch the full reactions to Episodes 1, 2, 3, and 4, and 5. On my Patreon, this is episode 6. Um, you can watch the full reaction to this episode on my Patreon as well. And if you're watching this episode on YouTube, this is episode 6. That would mean that episode 7 and 8 of Hotel would also be on my Patreon in full. Full reactions, same as everything else. So if you want to get in early, you can do so by signing up to my Patreon. If not, you can wait for me to upload it to YouTube for the 10 minute version um, and I promise I'm not going to take another two month break This is it now I've got my nice little background I don't have to worry about what's in the background I don't have to worry about my hair I can just literally just hair band it back Like it's sick And I've got my lights My lights as well makes my eyes look nice I think So thank you guys for watching again And I'll see you for episode 7 of Hotel Take it easy <laughs>